Now this is the intersection here. This is Clarendon Street and Nightingale Street, as you can see up there. So there's a car right on the intersection there. This bus has to turn right. Right, so this is a perfect example of what issues can happen. As you can see, Clarendon Street, as the bus goes up there, it actually goes at oh, probably a 10 or a 15 degree angle from the normal direction. So from Clarendon Street down there, she actually comes straight down. There's your bottle shop. And you can see there the road turns up to the right and there's the one Nightingale Street which is here marked for the new project. So again you can see what it would look like with a two-story building from there and you can see the other houses up the top there. So we really think that this is an extremely prominent position. It's a, a the position of the actual house. It gets seen from coming down Nightingale, it gets seen from coming up Nightingale from the um, park down there. So you can even see there with the Park Hotel. It's even an old heritage looking place there. So I don't know the year of it. But again you can see it's got the deco style up around the roof there. You know, it's just that new modern facade that, that's been permitted to paint that form of um, colour on it. Because before that it was just brick, the same as you see on the side there. So again, this is taking away an heritage overlay being permitted to paint like that. So this will give you a bit of an indication. of how the Shire is actually supporting and maintaining the heritage. So this is quite disappointing, but to see that, you can see, you know, all the houses up there. So again, you can see the houses, and how can they say that the new design fits in with the hospital? You can't even see the hospital from here. You know, same as the ambulance station. You can see the ambulance there up the top, but you can't actually see the station. So again with that, how putting in a modern two-storey building here that complements the design of the hospital and the ambulance station when you really can't even see it. So again, we'll go round and we'll go down and have a look at the Princes Park, Princes Park, down there, beautiful heritage place, so all across the front of Park Road, um, left and right down there, it's all beautiful heritage buildings, like you even just go and see down through there, you can see that's the side, it's um, now being used as um, accommodation, but you know, you can see the whole area and what it actually looks like. Would a two-storey modern brick build complement what we've got here? So we will leave that for yourself to decide. But again, we talk about the parking. Have a look at the parking just up there already. This has taken Tuesday afternoon, about 10 past one. So, you know, you can see, even with the parking here, there's not a lot of spaces. So by all means, I hope this helps you make your decision. So thank you.